Hello students, let's continue our journey through linear equations in one variable. Today we are going to deal with some applications of solving a linear equation, having a linear expression on one side and numbers on the other side. Look, there is a grasshopper and an ant, they are speaking about something. Come, let's hear what is it. I am eight days older than you. Did you know one thing? The sum of our ages is 36. Students, can you tell us what will be our present age? How can we solve their question? Let's take the age of grasshopper, be x days. Then, by the first condition, the age of the ant is x plus 8 days. Since the sum, of their ages is 36. x plus x plus 8 equals 36. That is 2x plus 8 equals 36. Transposing 8 to IHS. 2x equals 36 minus 8 equals 28. That is 2x equals 28. Transposing 2 from 2x to IHS and dividing IHS by 2. That is x equals 28 by 2. We get x equals 14. That is, the age of a grasshopper is x equals 14 days. And the age of an ant is x plus 8 equals 14 plus 8 equals 22 days. 22 days old. I am 14 days old. Let's see another example. Ravish has 1000 rupees in 10, 20, and 50 rupee notes. If the number of 10 rupee notes is 5 times the number of 50 rupee notes, and the number of 20 rupee notes are 10 less than that of 10 rupee notes, then how many notes does he have in each denomination? Let's try to understand the question. Here, Ravish has a total of 1000 rupees, but it is divided into 10 rupees, 20 rupees, and 50 rupees. Let's take the number of 50 rupees as x. Then the number of 10 rupee notes be 5x. The number of 20 rupee notes is 10 less than of 10 rupee notes. So the number of 20 rupee notes is 5x minus 10. Now, we have to calculate the amount from each denomination. That is, the amount from 50 rupees notes is 50 multiplied by x equals 50x. The amount from 10 rupees notes is 10 multiplied by 5x equals 50x. And the amount from 20 rupees notes is 20 multiplied by 5x minus 10, which is equal to 100x minus 200. the total amount is 1,000 rupees. That is 50x plus 50x plus 100x minus 200 equals 1,000. That is 200x minus 200 equals 1,000. Transposing minus 200 to IHS, 200x equals 1000 plus 200 200 x equals 1200 transposing 200 from 200 x to ihs and dividing by 200 therefore x equals 1200 divided by 200 equals 6. so the number of 50 rupees notes is x equals 6. 
The number of 10 rupees notes is 5x equals 5 multiplied by 6 equals 30. The number of 20 rupees notes is 5x minus 10 equals 5 multiplied by 6 minus 10 equals 30 minus 10 equals 20. Before winding up, let's check how much you understood by doing an activity. If you subtract 1 by 3 from a number and multiply the result by 2 by 5, you get 3 by 4. What is the number? That's all for now. See you all in the next class.